Hey, Brian from Garage Mall Hall. Today I have a Refun WF31 optical flow positioning drone, GPS drone. So let's open it up and take a look at everything that we get inside. Pretty awesome. So it says it's 250 grams, brushless motor, GPS return, and HD camera. So let's get this shrink wrap off. and totally awesome it comes in the case I mean that's it that's everything that's in the box it comes with a case so first things I love anything that has a case it just kind of like screams quality you know nice cushy handle nice compact so let's open it up and see everything that we get inside okay so We'll go through some of the basic stuff. So that is your user manual. I'll get that pulled out of the way, and that's your little pocket there. So that is going to be your. I believe that's probably going to be your battery. So let's open this up. Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff in here. All right, so all right, so that looks like it's one, two different charging cables. And this looks like a little pack of accessories. Let's see if I can't open this up without ripping it apart like I typically do. Sometimes they're just like so glued, it's like there's you have no recourse but to completely rip it open. Okay, so yeah, there's a bunch of stuff in here. And what I did not want to do is rip it completely open but I guess no choice all right so you got a bunch of replacement propellers a bunch of little screws for the propellers and little propeller separators and that bag is trash I'll probably put it back in the, the box okay so here's your battery maybe I can open oh okay so I can open a battery without destroying everything so let's put all these little parts back in here A bunch of replacement propellers. Kind of wish they had like it, their own little. I guess we can reuse that. All right, and that's the box, so that's done. So here's your battery, and just looking at it really quick. So looking for like the charge. Oh, okay. So this is how you charge a battery. So it's basically going to slide into place. So this is the top part of your battery right there, and then it's going to basically slide on the end of the battery and then you will slide it forward there we go so and that's how you charge that so let's undo the charging cable all right so that's the charging cable and then plug this in right here and get this charging so flip it around so basically i don't know if you can kind of see that but it's red and it has a green blinking light so my delusion is once this battery is charged it'll probably turn uh turn green let you know that that part of the process is done let's get this cable undone and ready so this is going to be for the remote once we get to that so let's just plug that in so we can get that going as well all right so let's plug in so let's get the the drone out with this bag, so pretty cool. All right, so obviously you move this legs out first. So the ones that have the little stands on it, pull the propellers out. So that's, and then that is your camera right there. And it's got a little protective coating on it. We're gonna take that off. So basically that is ready to go. Oh, you know what? That is super handy because it has a second battery right there. Cool, so it comes with two batteries. I didn't know that. Awesome. So again, that's charging. We'll charge this one up. Let's get the controller out. It has a nice thick block of foam on it. So we'll pull that out. And then that is your remote. Very neat. And then that is your antenna that comes up. 
and then we will plug that in here so my delusion is that little red light's going to go out or it will turn a different color when it's completely charged but you obviously know so let's put these little spare parts in over here let's take a look at the manual so what i like about this is it has a quick start guide so we can go through that process so it'll give you a diagram of transmitter charging getting the drone ready transmitter ready um, it also has a an app that you get onto your phone so that's all in there and then it has a thicker manual and it's going to have a bunch of stuff in there um, please read through the manuals in their entirety there is a lot of information i can't possibly cover in a video here and it will make your flying experience so much easier so definitely while all this stuff is charging up just take the time read through the manuals and you'll be good to go anyway let's move outside after this all charges up and i'll show you how to get going on your first flight so stay tuned okay so you have your drone and you want to get a memory card. I like to use at least a 32 gig or larger memory card. And then the memory card slot is here. So you're basically putting that in there. You're good to go. And then your battery, you are inserting in this orientation. And that clicks in. And then that is your button here to push in to basically release your battery if you had to. Then you pull your legs out. Once with the kickstands first. Then you unfold it like that. And then to turn your drone on, it's a quick one. And then you hold it for a quick second. And then that will turn that on. And you want to connect your remote. You turn the power button on and it'll start blinking. Lights red, up and then down. And then it'll turn solid and you'll get the blinking green light. So it's basically ready to, to go. You want to open up your Wi-Fi settings and you're going to be looking for the drone. And it's going to show up as we phone fly. So now we're connected. Then we open up the app. Hit preparations. Go into calibration. It says calibration is successful. Compass calibration. So we're going to be basically be doing kind of like a roll or a turn with this. So we're going to turn it. And then once it's done, it's going to be asking you to flip it this way. And then basically that calibration is done. So it's going to give you a couple of different questions, but then you can see that we are now active with the camera. And we're going to turn it this way. And then you have a one button takeoff and landing, which is here. So we're going to hit that. And then we're basically ready to lift off. Press it again. Okay, so you got a couple different modes on here. If you hit that camera, It'll turn into the record button, or if you leave it on camera, they'll take a picture. So that's a picture there. Or if you hit that, you can hit record.
Anyway, uh, Brian from Garage Mall Hall, thanks for watching and be safe out there.